What is going on, Phillies fans? Welcome to another video. And today we're going to do a little regular Star Wars review of the Imperial Light Cruiser. It should be... It could not be a very long video. I mean... Talk about a Lego set for however long. So we're going to get straight into this. Starting off with... The back. You can see in the back you got one, two, you got three things. None of this stuff opens. It's a very contained back. As you can see, boys, you know what that means. MLB The Show 21 stream coming out most likely tonight. So let's get continue this review. Um, we got these TIE Fighters here and take these out and show you them here. Many TIE Fighters. Playable in seven hours. Hour and 41 left. Okay, so you take this TIE Fighter right here. There's another one right in there. Go to the front of the ship. And you see those things right there? Let's open this. On those rails. And there's a little lever in the back. And they like, it's like they're flying out. I did it once good. There you go. That's a cool little play mechanism they have on this set. Very, very cool. So we are gonna now get into the cannons. They are flick fire missiles, as you can see. Boom, boom. And these turrets do spin. Like this. Spin around and around. These cannons do move up and down. Spin. And then there's cannons on the side here. That move up. And down. Uh, and down. Again, the inside you saw there. Same thing with this side. And now, the interior. So, talk, forgetting about that, let's talk about the minifigs for a second before we get into the interior base. So, for minifigs in this set, We'll first start off by talking about Grogu. Or the child. Then, Moff Gideon with the Darksaber. Next, my personal, the reason why I bought this set. Fennec. Shand. And Fennec can take her helmet off. She does have two faces. And you take Gideon's hair off. He also has two faces. Pretty cool stuff there. Figures consist of a dark trooper who has this head, so you can take the helmet off. Cardoon 
with like pop her hair piece off. I, I can't. Well, she also has multiple faces, and finally, Din Jaren, the Metal Lord. Okay, now let's go to the interior set here. If you will see, you got the interior set. There's not really much in the set that you can do. You can have Mando and Gideon battle here. And there's things in these crates. One has a thermal detonator and the other one has something else. And yeah, so, a part of this six minute review, our final objective is to set up play. It is my favorite part. Let's just go, carry right here. Of course, Din on the other side. Let's grab our big Yoda and put him Like such, right there. Let's take Gideon, and of course he's gonna go right in the center. And the Dark Trooper. And he's a pretty blatantly obvious one. He's gonna go right here. Oh, next to Gideon. Trying to get poked by Baby Yoda. And finally, Fennec Shand will be going right. Now you got everybody cross-firing each other. Set it down. And it is a perfect, oh, not a perfect fit. Oh, it, yep, not a perfect fit. Where is it? Let's take Frank out there. Oh, no, that's just how it looks. Okay, yes, it is a perfect fit. Because... Actually, no, it isn't. Okay. Well. It's okay. We can just mingle around a little bit. Like. By a little bit, I mean. Find where these guys go and then put it down. Perfect. Late, like such. So that is the Imperial Light Cruiser. Hopefully you enjoyed this review. And I will see you next time. Peace.